Hey fam, welcome back. I'm Teresa Von Regan, and this channel is about all things beauty, health, and wealth. And today we are gonna make five-star guacamole. Welcome to my paradise on the Von Regan back deck. This is a must-have recipe for you. My friends and family always say this is their favorite guacamole. And I finally decided to put pen to paper, measure everything out, and get it just right for you and my family. When making guacamole, it's so important to have the right tools. This is the perfect bowl for your avocados. I have six avocados in here, and I searched and searched for years for the right bowl to fit the guacamole, and I finally found it. So the link is in the description below. Then, I love to serve my salsa in this grinder bowl, and I love that it has the grinder so I can smash my guacamole or my avocado. And then lastly, I have a spoon and a fork, which we'll use in a moment, and of course, all my ingredient cups. As you know, guacamole starts with a base of avocado. So in this bowl are six peeled avocados and cut in half and left whole. Now we're gonna pour in our lime, and this is great because it has that nice zesty flavor, but it keeps the avocado from turning brown and your guacamole from turning brown. Then we're gonna add in the spices, and this is cumin and cayenne pepper. Cumin's a nice Spanish ingredient, um, like a Spanish spice, and cayenne pepper's a great spice that gives you a little bit of a punch. If your kids don't like that punch, you can take that ingredient out that has that heat. And then of course salt, and I love to use kosher salt, but any kind of salt is great. And everything goes better with garlic, so we have about six garlic cloves, chopped up finely. Onion, and I chose red onion to give nice color. You can use any kind of onion. And mm -mm, good tomato, some fresh summer flavor, and look at that beautiful color. And I chose my ingredients carefully to give color, flavor, and heat. Cilantro gives that nice flavor, so a generous amount of cilantro. I love cilantro from my fresh herb garden. And everything, every guacamole goes better with chili or jalapeno. And I have some green chilies from a can, but you can also use fresh jalapeno. Now that we have all the ingredients in the bowl, the best way to mix this is to first use a fork and just fork your avocado a little bit to separate it. So you're gonna fork each half and you can use the side a little bit to mush it, but you don't wanna mush it too much because you want your guacamole nice and chunky and nice big chunks of the avocado in the guacamole. Next, you're gonna take your grinder and just grind it up a little bit but not too much. Too much mixing is gonna make your avocado too mushy. Now that we're finished mashing our five-star guacamole, we're gonna serve it up to our friends and family. And I know you're gonna love this five-star guacamole just as much as we do in the Von Regan home. So don't forget, like, subscribe, and smash that bell so you can get notifications about the next video and comment below with what recipe you want to see next. This looks so good. Bye for now, fam. Mm -hmm.